Hello girls, um, last video I gave the notes for consumer behavior. I am very happy. Some of them noted that ma'am you are not uh, taught about that particular topic. Eh? That is asked in four more question. What do you mean by price elasticity of demand? So that I thought of uh, today to the class. So what do you mean by first before going to the price elasticity? Elasticity. The first what is what is mean by elasticity? Elasticity means responsiveness. That is reaction. Responsiveness means uh, we call it as a reaction. So here what what reaction we are going to find out? You know very well demand. Demand means general formula is Q D is equal to function of price. So how price is going to react uh, the, after the change in the price what is the reaction of the quantity demanded that is called the elasticity that is a response what what is what is one variable to other variable what is the change is happening you know very well according to law of demand price increases demand will decrease but now you want to know how much is going to increase or how much is going to decrease that calculation is called the elasticity of demand so this if it is calculating in terms of price we call it as a price elasticity there are three concept is there price elasticity income elasticity and the cross elasticity so we are going to see only the price elasticity that is why i wrote this one qd is equal to function of price so if the if the price increased to 10% what will happen to the quantity demanded definitely it is going to decrease how much it is going to decrease if it is 10% same 10% it's going to decrease or it is going to decrease 5% or it's going to decrease 5% 15% this calculation we call it as a elasticity of demand this is called the price elasticity there are different type five types is there that is elastic inelastic either perfectly elastic perfectly inelastic unitary elastic relatively less elastic relatively more elastic generally elastic elastic means demand is more inelastic means demand is less generally inelastic means demand is less elastic means more that is response is more response is less don't confuse yourself we are talking only about the response or reaction how much because of change in price quantity demand will change everybody know that how much it is going to change if it is more changes we call it as elastic if it is less changes we call it as a inelastic and this term this concept first you used by alfred marshall okay so now no next i am going to give the formula and simple one sum Okay, well, what is about this uh, el elasticity of demand will be denoted by ed ed is equal to percentage change in the quantity demanded percentage change in the quantity demanded by percentage change in the price change in the price here quantity demanded and the quantity, this is a formula ed is equal to percentage change we will see the sum now Now, note what is this? this is a formula. I, mean, I don't know percentage change in the con, uh, demand and percentage change in the price. The P E D means E D means I told el elasticity of demand. P means price elasticity of demand. This is a delta Q delta P is this is a change in the quantity. This is change in the price. This is the initial price and the quantity initial quantity. This is a sum given in your book. Okay, here the given the old price is five. When it is a five, how much they bought fifteen kgs. When they increase the price to seven rupees, how much they bought the quantity demanded is twelve. So we have to apply in the formula. So what is the delta Q means change in the quantity. So change in the quantity how much it is change is fifteen minus twelve three. Change in the quantity. They like the change in price. What is the change in the price? Five is uh, minus seven two, and into P means original price, initial price. Q means initial quantity. Initial price is how much? Five. Initial quantity is how much? Fifteen. Then we can simplify three ones are one here five. Again this five and five will cancel. So what will be the answer? Will be one by two. One by two means how much? Oh. Uh, got the answer zero point five. So how will now now will what is the response now? It is more or less? Yeah, you should know or not. So suppose E D is greater than one or E D is lesser than one and E D is equal to one. I told already different types elasticity is there. Elastic and inelastic, unitary elastic also is there. This means more than one and less than one. More than one means response is more elastic demand. Less than one means inelastic. That is response is less. E one is equal. That is both going in the same. Uh, that the response is equal. How much changes? How much is the less? Now it is less than one. So what elastic it is? 
it is an inelastic. So, the, 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 the reaction or response of the price and quantity demanded is an inelastic. Response is less according to the sum what is given in your book. If you only this much explain enough. Thank you girls.